You know, we all know that there is absolutely no shortage of delicious seafood here on Del Mar, but that, my friend, includes tuna. My favorite, and that's exactly what's on the menu today. Joining us now is Mike Lawson and Chef Katie Baltzell from Barn 34 in Ocean City. Hey, guys, thanks for joining Hi. us this afternoon. Thanks for letting us on the show. Yeah, what thank are, you so much. <laughs> what are we making? Uh, we're going to do a seared tuna with a little spice on it over some buckwheat, or also known as soba noodles, and oh. a citrus soy sauce with some veggies in there as well. Ooh, that wow. sounds good. All right, so tell Here's us what we need. Uh, we, we obviously need the tuna. Yep. Right, so we're going to go ahead and spice your tuna. You're just going to roll the edges of it in that mixture there. It's a little bit of fennel, cumin, salt, pepper, garlic. Okay, and just the edges. Just the edges, edges. Okay. yeah. Just want a little bit of that flavor. All Look right. All right, she's hard at work on the tuna. What yeah. do you need me to do? It's got our pan nice and hot. I turned your pan on for you. You're going to add a little bit of olive oil started. in there. Wait, she's seen me in the kitchen hot. before. A little olive oil. Yeah. Okay. okay Much? Just a little there. bit. Just a little. There you go. Good. We've got some garlic over here for you. Yeah. Just toss that in. All of it? Not all of it. Not all. God, How no. much? No, no, no. Oh. we got to be together now. Yeah. Oh. Just a pinch. <laughs> a pinch of garlic. Just a pinch, yep. Right. Yeah, you got to watch him with it. Let me. Oh, man, I'm telling you, I love my garlic. I love garlic, too. All that, though. And then I did all the work this morning for you. Got your veggies ready to go here. You're my favorite. I'm just letting you know. You can go ahead and toss. Those in? Okay. No, we want all those. No Ooh. pinch of that. All right. So then we're just going to let these cook down a little bit. Okay. We're going to sear the side of our tuna. We okay. try to serve it medium rare, but uh -huh. if you come into barn, we'll cook it however you want it. Oh, okay. So really? Yeah, of course. Nice. So tell us a little bit about Barn 34. What What is your specialty? Uh, well, we're, we, we were originally known for breakfast, mm -hmm. but, uh, you know, in the past couple of years, we've been doing dinner, and we got uh, Katie and our other uh, chef, Amy, who's actually manning the station back at the restaurant tonight, <laughs> today. But, uh, we we are doing seasonal uh, menus. We're doing a winter seasonal mm -hmm. or, and then a summer seasonal, and this is part of our summer spring seasonal. And these girls are doing a great job with it, and uh, we'll have a rotating menu every year, so we'll have some variations to it. And yeah. uh, they're doing a great job. Nice. Okay, so you put some salt on there. Just have a little salt, yeah. And you can go ahead and flip that now. Go ahead that and flip side's it. cooked. Okay. There's only so far that a chef can watch you do something and then. You want me to get a plate? Yeah, because, you know, I, oh, I thought you were going to do the thing where you yeah, toss that in there. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, okay. he's going to. Yeah, oh, I've yet to learn how to do that. that. I've been shown. Well, he works breakfast in the morning, so oh, he's a natural. Okay. Okay. I, can, I can cook breakfast, but I, I leave I leave the dinner to the, these girls. <laughs> so you can go ahead and get this uh, citrus soy sauce in there. There's lots of fresh ginger and garlic in that as well. We'll add that to our vegetables. Again, how much? Uh, about two tablespoons. I'll tell you when if you want to do that. About two, you think I don't want to <laughs> I'll tell you that. when. You can do it that way. Okay. If you don't tell him, like he'll pour the whole thing in there. It. A little bit more. I like it a little saucy. There you go. A little saucy. And then we can throw your noodles in too. Okay, ready for and, and, th and that's interesting. You said they're buckwheat noodles? They're buckwheat, so they're actually gluten free, which means that, you know, people that have that intolerance can eat them. And they're a little nutty. You yeah. know, they're better than oh. just a plain noodle. Okay. I love buckwheat right. cakes. Yeah, you buckwheat flour is awesome. Yes, yes, yes. So, how long does this take? This is a quick dish. You know, yeah. our, soon is, our tuna is almost done. It's probably mm -hmm. about a minute away. Right. We could even turn this off. You know, you're right there as well. You're probably yeah. about yeah. two minutes away, and then we're going to put it all together. Oh, okay. okay. Yeah. All right. So it's a, it's a nice, easy one. You can definitely make this at your house, but I'm not going to lie. We're going to do it better. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> at least you're honest about yeah. it. Thank it, you it so much. Of course. <laughs> so there you go. All right. Oops, sorry. Nope, there, we got a go right back in there. <laughs> we got a jumper there. All, All right. right. Okay. So uh, what we're going to do is we're going to finish this up a little bit. Then we're going to come back. We're going to plate it up, and we're going to get to my favorite part: tasting. What do you yes. think of that? Oh, Sounds yeah. great. All like right. Don't go anywhere. Delmar Live's going to be right back.